have to disagree with you because I see you throwing off a lot of numbers, but it looks like you're reading cue cards or watching a teleprompter. It's about 100 degrees today. It was hot. So, I know a lot of people. I know a lot of uh, white guys with Asian women. I know a lot of black guys with Asian women. I know a lot of white guys with black women. I know a few black guys with white women. And happiness, young lady, is where you find it. You can't go follow a statistic and expect the statistic to be correct because the people you may encounter may not be the same kind of people that they put in the study where you're getting your numbers from. In other words, what neighborhoods did they go into when they uh, did these polls that you're quoting? What, what, where did the information come from? You know? So, what I'm trying to say is this. You make some points. Yes, you do. You do make some points. But, based on the studies that you're getting your information from, what group of people will come out and say, you know, in all the relationships I had, I've had better relationships with the white women I've had. Or, you know, out of all the relationships I had, I've had better relationships with white this or Asian that. If you really want to find happiness, it doesn't matter what or who you find happiness with. You have to be looking for happiness. You have to be wanting to be happy with this person that you've chose. Period. It's not, oh, I have a better chance of being happy with a white guy. That, that's, that's illogical. That's illogical for you or any other woman or man to read a piece of paper or watch something on TV and assume just because you've seen it on TV or read it in a book that it's actually true. Have you ever, ever saw a movie review and they're like, you know, the new Will Smith movie really did not, you know, whatever. And then when you went, or when you finally said, you know, no, I ain't doing nothing. Let me go see that movie. And it was not what you thought it would be because the person's opinion was not like yours. You know? So I can't agree with any poll, any study. You can study a thousand people. And, and and what if what if this thousand people versus that thousand people this thousand people say you have better life with a black person and that thousand people say you have better life with a white person then whose report would you believe you know you, you can't base happiness or the feeling of happiness on a poll or a study Life itself is a lesson. The lessons you learn are not going to be the lessons I learned. The lessons I have learned, you, you probably won't ever even get nowhere near those lessons. Life is what you make it, young lady. Who you choose to spend your life with is totally your choice. You might be happy with this guy for three years break up with him and think, well, I'm going to go get with the same kind of guy this was and get with the same kind of person and that person completely rubbed you completely wrong and then you're going to say, well, maybe it's because I experienced that with this guy. So now you're going to say, well, every one of these guys that look like this is only good for two months or three months. Happiness creeps up on you. Love slaps you on the side of the face and you don't know what to do. So in real life, you can't follow a study to find yourself. You can't follow a study to find your man or your woman or whatever you want. A study won't help you find happiness. Only you will. And in saying that, I must end this video. But I can only end the video with a proper send-off. You have been tubed.